in this video we are going to create a bank account in sap so to do that uh, what we will do is we'll go to our transaction code fi01 and we'll give a country key as us for us the will give a routing number so let's say bank routing number something so i have given the bank routing number in india we have a ifsc code and uh, european countries we they have a bank number something so we can give that uh, uh, bank key then the bank name will be not jp morgan i will go with city city bank and then branch bank branch city bank new york city or something postal code street street whatever the address details are there we'll give all the address details city mark and this postal code sorry it's the postal code should be one two three four five then the city is uh, so i'm giving any random numbers or uh, random details here but you can fill all the informations and the reason reason will be like uh, new york region and you have to give the proper details uh, which we need to get it from the customer so swift code i will call it as city bank number i will not give any bank number if we want we can give the same bank key as a bank number also and save it this is just a warning message it will give because it's saying that swift code is not correct so we need to give the proper swift code okay so the bank key 3456789090 is created after that we need to create a house bank to create the house bank we'll go to our transaction code f512 so once that is done select your company so we'll go to our company code people are one and then we'll go to a house bank so here in the house bank go to create new entries and give the house bank as city and country us bank key we have created bank key as 3456790 and then press enter and save it so bank key and house bank is been created now to create a bank account so what we will do is we will go to gl account first and we'll create one gl account main gl account so let's say i'm just for uh, learning purpose i'm just creating one account copy this so i will call it as 200 press enter this is going to be a city main account okay go to a control data open item management is not needed for the main account G005 cash relevant to cash flow that is fine so we'll use this gl account to create a our bank okay now to create the bank what we will go do is we'll go to a fury app so before logging to fury i will just add some of the information So now I'm into your Fury screen now. So in Fury, what I will do is I recently opened 
that uh, app so i will just select that one so to create a bank account we need to go to a manage bank account app so this is the app if you want you can search from here or uh, you can get it from a security access it means uh, with the security team get this app manage bank account so once you get this bank account app so you will have three options either you, somewhere you will see a create option or if you are not able to see that create option click on this and click on create so once that is done so give your company code details equal r1 and the uh, account type current account continue so once this is done so we need to give the account description so i will just give a salary current account and the city bank real account number we need to give so let's say i'm just giving a random number but uh, in real scenario we know like we have to give a real account number the country is us and bank key is three four five six seven city bank key which we have created so that we need to give it here currency this account is maintained in usd currency if any other currency you are maintaining that we need to maintain here iban is not needed control key i'm just giving a random number here on the control key now we'll go to a uh, just press enter here and we'll go to a control entry so here we are not going to enter anything so now we'll go to a bank relationship under bank relationship also we will not maintain anything so this is a house bank account is the important one so where we need to map the house bank so to do that we just need to click on create option here click on create and then yeah, sometimes it takes time let me click anywhere i am clicking so it's a network issue let's wait okay now now what i will do is i will try to click on this create option still not allowing let me Yeah. So you will see this uh, options once you create on the create option. Now, here what you need to do is here we have whatever created house bank. So that house bank details will show up here. Now we need to give the house bank account number here. So I will give the house bank as city one and we'll scroll down here. I just need to give the GL account. So the GL account, which we have created is let's copy it from So here under assets, so this is a GL account which we have created. Copy this GL account and go to Fury and give the GL account here and click on apply. And there is one more checkbox which I need, I forgot, use in the cash pooling and click on apply. So once this is done, 
So first we'll be saving this as a inactive. And this is just a warning message. So we'll close this one. If it is an error message, then we'll need to add that one. As it is a warning message, we'll ignore. And sometimes the opening date of the account and everything, we need to give it correctly. So I just given this uh, account number here. And click on activate. Close. So the say GL account has been created means uh, the GL account which is related to Citibank has been created with the bank account or bank account is CT1. Now we'll go to SAP. We'll see this is the GL account which got created in that particular bank account. We'll go to FI12 again and here we'll go to position, we'll select our company code, triple R1 is our company code, select this one, double click on the house bank, select city bank and you will click on the bank account. So it will show as a read only answer. So you will see that the city bank one, which we have created as an account ID has been created. This is the bank account details, which we have given. This is the GL accounts, uh, which we have given. So all the information has came in. So we can use this house bank and the account ID for our future purposes, wherever needed for the payment. Thank you.